Hi, my name is Stephanie DC. I am from Lynchburg, Virginia. I'm 42 years old, uh, 41 actually, I'll be 42 years old. I'm a mother of two and um, I was diagnosed with stage four lung cancer uh, exactly one year ago. It's, um, it was July 2010 and um, I've always been in fitness for about the last 20 years and I've been running group fitness programs and teaching people about nutrition and group fitness. I've been a personal trainer. I'm a presenter for one of the national organizations, so I've always been into health. I um, didn't feel well for a, just a couple of weeks. I, I had been a little short of breath. had a cough, but just thought it was allergy related. And Anyway, I went to the doctor and they said I had pneumonia, so a walking pneumonia, so I figured that's all I had. And this was um, the weekend of July 4th. I think it was about July 9th by the time they, I had they put me through a couple of tests and figured out it was pneumonia. Put me on an antibiotic and 10 days later it wasn't gone. Um, put me through more blood tests and anyway, kept putting me through all these tests and I was wondering why for pneumonia. But it wasn't going away and they obviously thought it was something more. Went back to my regular doctor after 10 days. Uh, he continued doing tests and sent me on to a lung specialist at this point because we try, I said just try a different antibiotic. I'm sure it's you know, pneumonia, we'll, we'll take care of it, we'll get rid of it, and he sent me to a lung, um, a specialist, and they put me through a series of tests, and the last test, he brought me into his office and told me I had stage four lung cancer. <laughs> what do you do with that? Uh, I, I jumped out of my body, basically, and uh, he was continuing to talk and tell me it wasn't good. Um, I had a very rare kind of lung cancer. I, it's a kind that attacks women who don't smoke in their 40s. I had just turned 40. I've never smoked. And all he could say is in his 30 years of um, practicing, he had only seen maybe three or four cases. And he was very sorry. <laughs> okay, that's all you can give me.